Hey, what's going on guys? Ravi here from Ira FX along with Mr. Zebo. Welcome you to another Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial. So in this video, I'm going to be telling you three ways to generate this RGB split effect in a very simple way. So without any delay, let's get started. Alright, so I have a video in my project. Let me drag this to the right side panel here so that a sequence is created. So we'll be adding this RGB split to this video here. So in order to do that, the first way that we're going to explore is to go to the FX panel and type in VR. So you have this VR chromatic aberrations effect and simply drag this onto your video just like this. So you'll see a warning saying that this effect requires GPU acceleration. So all these effects in the immersive video effects, all the effects that has VR require this GPU acceleration. So if you have a graphic card or graphic drivers in your um, system, you can go to the project settings and general and change the renderer to, you know, playback engine that has GPU acceleration and hit OK. So now you see that there's this RGB split here happening. So this effect, you know, works only if you have some graphics um, engine enabled in your system. Unfortunately, if you don't have that, this effect is not going to work for you. But don't worry, we have a couple of more effects that does not require the graphical in uh, graphical render so um, you can tweak the values here for aberration uh, red and green and you have this some um, distort effect so i'll reduce the fall of distance to zero and you can tweak the values here in order to get the desired uh, rgb split that you're looking for so if i play the video this is how it's gonna look like but you cannot tweak these values, you know, based on um, your requirements. So I'll show you another effect. So in the second way, what we're going to be doing is um, go to the FX panel and type in arithmetic. So you have this arithmetic effect in the channel folders and simply drag this onto your video just like this. So now we have this arithmetic effect in your video and I'll change the operator to max. So you have the max here and I'll change the blending mode to linear dot add all right and I'll then change the red value to 255 to the maximum extent possible now I'll hold alt on my keyboard and duplicate it two times just like this so to the second video I'll reduce the red value to zero and increase the green value to 255 and I'll also do the same thing I'll reduce the red value here and increase the blue value just like this so everything gets balanced so, so the red green and blue color you know they get balanced and you get you know like this and now in order to get the split to the direction that you want click on this video and simply move the position to the right if you want some green or yellowish tint color to the right side here and also tweak the other values in such a way that you get this RGB split effect just like this you can also scale this a bit just so that it looks something like this it all depends on your requirements so if you play this this is how it's gonna look like perfect so the last effect, the third effect that we're going to do is using an effect called color balance. So I'll go to the effects and simply type in color balance. So we'll be using this color balance in the image control here. So um, let me delete the arithmetic effects in all these three clips. Just to give you an idea of this effect using color balance RGB. So I'll drag this effect onto these three videos just like this. And to the bottommost video, what I'll do is I'll reduce the red and green values. And for the other one, I'll reduce the red and blue values. And for the topmost video, I'll reduce the blue and green values 
So now you can see that you know you have this RGB split effect applied because we also changed the position earlier. So you can see these effects like this. So you can have different ways. There are different ways you can have this RGB split effect and it all depends on your shot and your requirement this effect is usually applied in some music videos wherein you want to show some trippy effects so this is how you generate some RGB split effect using Adobe Premiere Pro I hope you like this video and if that's the case give us a thumbs up and if you'd like to talk with me regarding visual effects and video editing you can always reach out to me on Instagram at VFXGuyRavi Mr. Zebo, would you like to add something? Subscribe for more tutorials. Alright, so see you guys next time with another tutorial.